Good morning, everybody. My name is Jack Kasarjan. I'm the owner of Third Shot Drop Custom Pickleball Paddles, and we're here in Morro Bay, California, educating players on pickleball paddle materials and offering demo paddles for everybody to try to pick the paddle that fits them. Uh, we make custom pickleball paddles, and a lot of people think that custom means that you get to have a nice graphic on the face of the paddle, but there's a lot more to it. Um, we are obsessed with performance, and cosmetics are fun, but really what we're trying to do is help people become better pickleball players. And so to, to understand what we do, it's necessary to understand how a paddle is made. So every paddle has got a honeycomb core, and the different companies in the industry use these three materials for the core. The core is about 75% of the way a paddle performs. The core is sandwiched between two very thin layers of surface materials. The surface material is about 25% of the paddle's performance. These three materials are the different surfaces the different companies in the industry use. Again, we use them all. So these three cores and these three surfaces make nine different combinations of materials. Each one performs a little differently. These are our nine models. Every model is available in both the Chaos and Kratos shapes. So, the top row is aluminum cores. Aluminum cores are uh, softer. They slow the ball down. They're good for your dinks. They're good for your third shot drops. They're good for your control. In the middle is the polymer core. Most of the paddles out there are polymer core with composite surface because it's the most average and it's also the cheapest by far. So the big companies, the Paddle Techs, the Engagers, the Selkirks, they can send out these $10 paddles like they're nothing and not worry about it. Um, and then the Nomex core has got a lot more pop. That's what Elliot uses. He likes the, the feel of the Nomex. So the idea is, instead of saying, you know, we're, we're Engage, we're Selkirk, we're Head, and this is gonna be a perfect paddle for you, because we make this paddle for every player on the planet. And you're exactly like Elliot, you're exactly like him, you're exactly like that woman over there, and you're exactly like me. So the paddle should be great for you. No, instead of trying to fit you into our paddle, we fit our paddle to you. So you choose your core, your surface, your weight, your handle shape, your grip size, we have them in eighth inch increments from four inches for real small hands up to six inches for big hands. And your grip material, this is the flat, this is the ridge, this is the stitched, and your grip color. One thing that Third Shot Drop does is give some love to our lefties out there. Most players don't realize that the grips are wrapped in the opposite direction for left-handed players. As you can see, the grip on the left is wrapped for a left-handed player, and the grip on the right is wrapped normally for a right-handed player. Having the grip wrapped in the proper direction is more comfortable and also helps players hold the paddle more securely but relaxed because they are holding the grip in the direction their fingers wrap around the handle. So now you have something that's actually built for you, that you feel is an extension of your arm when you play, as opposed to getting used to something just because that's what it is. Um, you can also put a custom graphic on, as you can see which is fun, but really the point of custom is the materials, the performance, not so much the looks. But a lot of people like the looks. We had three gals yesterday in Cambria that had a, ha having us make custom paddles with the, uh, the, the Hawaiian look. So what we normally do to start you off is you choose your, your, your shape, either the elongated shape, which has got a rectangular sweet spot, or that's called the uh, Kratos, or the square shape, which has a more wide face, and that's called the Chaos. And then we give you three paddles that are identical, except for the core. So you have the same surface, the same weight, the same handle shape, the same grip size, the same material, the only difference is the core. You go out, 
hit with those, come back and say, I really like this core. Then we give you the other two surfaces that go with that core. Now you come back and say, I like this core, but I really like the way this surface feels. And then it's just the weight fit in the handle. And as long as you don't want a custom face, we can make it here in about 10 minutes. So this gentleman here, he, he just finished stage two. He started with the three different uh, cores. Then he just took out, so he liked the aluminum core. Then he took out the aluminum core with the graphite, carbon fiber, and composite and compared them. And now he knows this is the one that feels the best to him. Next thing is fitting him to the handle shape, the grip size, the grip material, the grip color. And now he's got something that was actually built for him that he knows fits him, not what we're telling him fits him. So that's kind of the whole point of, of custom is to, to get something that, that works for you. Pickleball is the only sport where people are using off-the-shelf equipment. Every other sport you can think of, people are using equipment that was built for them. Golf, hockey, tennis, baseball, you name it, they're using something that was built for them instead of off the shelf. So we're, we're leading the charge for, for the players. Um, I started off making custom baseball bats 20 years ago. And we have over 300 major leaguers swinging our bats. And we were the only ones that were doing custom at the time. And now everybody has to do it because people demand it. So we think pickleball is going to go that way because of the way it's growing. And the amount of time people play pickleball, why not have the best equipment? You're spending a lot of time, you're spending a lot of energy, and it is the least expensive equipment in any sport. So people kind of make sense. So would you like to, like to demo them?